Also this afternoon, police in the quiet town of Orville are investigating a murder. And it appears the victim got shot with a gun he was trying to sell to his killer. Scott Taylor has more from Wayne County. It appears the victim and the shooter knew each other very well, could have been friends. And the preliminary motive for the murder, it looks like it was over a woman. The early morning shooting took place here at this intersection just minutes outside of Orville, Ohio, in Wayne County. Friends of 25 year old Michael Armstutz tells us they were told he was shot to death at the intersection of Smucker and Chippewa Road. He was picked up at his home down the road by two people overnight. Both were considered friends. One of them had shown interest in a gun Michael was trying to sell. Jessica English, a former girlfriend, says Michael is a talented tattoo artist and showed us one piece of work he did on her when they were dating. She was set to meet him later this week until she heard the horrible news he had been killed. He was really sweet and kind. He was, you know, very great with my daughter. Um, he was a really great guy. We had a lot of fun, you know, we went out and did stuff and he was just really fun to be around. He was outgoing and he loved doing tattoos. Sources tell us the victim got out of the car right here with the suspect, took a shot at a stop sign, handed the gun then over to the suspect. That's when he opened fire on the victim, hit him once, and then the victim took off into the woods, and then the suspect shot him four more times. Right now, two people are locked up in a jail in Wayne County in connection to the murder. Michael's friend tells us he had a tough childhood in foster homes, but was embracing life as an adult. This is 19 year old Larry Finn. He is a friend of Michael's. He has been arrested, though not charged yet in connection with Michael's murder. Another person was also taken in. That person has been arrested. Mr. Finn is locked up right now in the Wayne County Jail in Orville. Scott Taylor, 19 Action News.